you guys. <laughs> you guys got me with an early freaking happy freaking. Well, I, told I, was like, well, I should be up by now. <laughs> I can't believe you said we're losing seven agents. I had, I had a question. So yeah. Going to the Vegas. Um, did you say we? I have. I have a space, but I want to know where that would be. Um, I'm going to put you in any Caesars property. I haven't picked yet. It's going to okay. be, the, the places are going to be, I don't know where yet, but it's going to be either Rio, Harris, Bally's, um, Caesars, uh, Cromwell, Link, any, any of those. I just don't know where it is yet. She must be like, Hotel 6 because of the <laughs> no, it won't be Motel 6. Oh, okay, the Hawaii, the Hawaii trip. Uh-huh. Parasailing? <laughs> Is he giving you vlogging advice? That's right. We're giving our vlogging fa- advice our, our famous from a nine-year-old. Hey, Shane, YouTube. you have the, the movie to be. Yeah. The movie to be in tomorrow. He starts shooting for his movie. So. What's the movie called? Um, the movie is called. He is gonna. Oh, I can't say. Can't tell you. The oh, heck. Okay, so hey, listen. This is important. When you do on Royal Caribbean, mm-hmm. when you do cruise training as a travel agent. Yeah. You get to pick, at once you do the training, which is roughly around two hours, which I did already, you get to pick a cruise anywhere from, for two people, yeah. anywhere from three days to 30 days. So I really want to pick that cruise on where to go, so we can go pretty much anywhere. So do you have any ideas of what cruise you want to go on? Yeah. Where you want to go? I, I remember you giving me like a list of a bunch of places that we can go to. Yeah, so... What places do you like? I want to go where there's obviously lots of culture. I want to go to Jamaica. Let me go to Jamaica and cute maybe Cuba, Jamaica. Okay. But it's completely free. We just have to pay the taxes. The taxes are hundred and thirty dollars. That's pretty sweet. I was can, thinking... can any who can do that? Like, can anybody do that? Well, the, the agents in Evolution Travel. Okay. But, I mean, what I was thinking is get a few of my friends to come in because to become an agent, it's only 30 bucks. And if they could come on the cruise with us, yeah. become an agent. If it's for them, great. If it's not. Do a quick two hour, two hour. Uh... What are we doing? Yeah. Talking to you, trying to figure out what the day is going to be like today. Oh. Trying to make a plan. What's that thing you always say? Plan to fail. What do you say? Plan to fail. <laughs> no, no, plan to fail. <laughs> fail the plan. <laughs> if fail you the fail plan. to plan, then you plan to fail. <laughs> <laughs> no, we don't plan to fail in this family, that's for sure. I have to. What's with people adding on at the last minute? I have a group that I need to book, and another group, and they want to add an extra person. I think what happens is. When people tell their friends and family that they're going on a trip, then they sell it to them. And then they, they're like, oh, well, we want to come. And then they just start adding people. It would be much easier for me as a travel agent for them to give it to me in all in one shot, right? Yeah. But it never works out like that. Oh, well, more the merrier. People always want to vacation together. Okay. And if there's a movement, there's always people that want to tag along like oh man they're going oh i want to go too all right so should we go where it's well like ice or tropical That's... tropical all day okay so jamaica because i want to go to duns river falls i told you i want to go there okay. i've been there so jamaica. a few times already and i want to take you there i think cuba because they just opened cuba to the u.s that's uh-huh. super exciting okay. cuba jamaica we've already been to bahamas Yeah, let's ask the viewers where you guys think we should go on the on our free cruise. Like, let us know. 
Oh, or Hawaii. We could do the two-week Hawaii. They have a two-week Hawaii, and you stop at like five different islands. <laughs> it's, it's two weeks, and I believe the taxes, we only have to pay the taxes, but I don't pay anything else. It's something like 200 bucks. So that's an option also. I like that. I'll only go if, uh, go to Hawaii if Rayanne will be there. Okay. I want to go to her, her auntie's place, get all that star food we got last night. By it's the nice. way, guys, if you're new to this channel, please subscribe. Also, hit the like button if you like our channel. Yeah. Oh, someone from someone I went to school with contacted me on Facebook. They saw my video and they're like, "Hey, I didn't even know you were a travel agent." I'm like, "What? How does someone not know I'm a travel agent?" Like. Yeah, it's all over your everything that you do. I thought I was like telling everyone, screaming to the world, hey, I, I book travel. I can help you if you come to Vegas or go anywhere in the world or cruises and airfare. And I thought that I'm like super loud about it. Anyway, apparently someone called me that I went to school with and um, she said, well, how can I become a travel agent? So it's well, pretty funny. Guess we'll just have to show her how, right? Yeah, it's hilarious. Okay. I got to be a little bit more loud. Like, oh, I'm a travel agent. It's gorgeous. That's not being loud, honey. It's gorgeous in Vegas. All right. No one goes, oh, I'm a travel agent. I'm a travel agent, guys. Yeah. Guys, I'm a travel agent. I'm a travel agent. Guess what? I am too. Hey, get out of here. Where? 30 years in Illinois. Awesome, awesome. All right. Wow. Have a great day. See? <laughs> now that's being loud. We're about to pig out with our good friends, Kevin and... We have a tough life. Audra. Going to eat Korean barbecue. Yeah, we're about to pig out. Over well, here. you guys can pig out. I have to book travel. I have to book uh, two groups. Two actually small families, not groups. But Where are they going? Vegas. One group to Vegas. Okay. And I have one network marketing company that's also coming to Vegas. And yeah, like some kind of convention? Yeah, I can't name who they are, but yes. Okay. So well, that's going to be book, awesome. Um, it's going to be awesome. How many people? Them. Two groups? Mm, 12. 12. Our good friend Kevin. He's good. <laughs> How's it going? Hi. Hi. What are we We're about doing? to eat. Yeah. Are you we, guys ready we, to pick up? Absolutely. You walked all the way down? Well, we w parked way over there. We did the whole thing. We had a bowl. the New York, New York at the hotel. Yeah. Extravaganza. Oh, this oh. is the spirit light world famous from Houdini's. The light oh. goes through your head. You know what happens if you put a light through your head too many times? What? You get lightheaded, right? Inhale oh. the light, Whoa. have it come back out, or eat it. That's a light snack. <laughs> you can throw it up and show nothing in the hand, nothing in the back of the hand, and just ride it back out. Split it in two, throw it up, say, I got the power. Oh, put it man. through your legs, in the pocket, out the pocket. Now, I'm going to put a few in my hand, ma'am. I just want you to tell me how many you think are in the hand right here, if you guys had to guess. Five. Hey, a lot of people say five, three. See, there's nothing in the hand. And that is the spirit. Like, anyone six and up can do that trick. So, you well, say, going, I got a bunch of cards right here, right? This is one of my favorite, one of the tricks that got me into magic. Okay? Watch his hands. Now, let's say, you can watch them. You're not going to see anything but magic, all right? So I just want you to say stop for me, ma'am. Are you ready? Yes. All right, go ahead. Stop. Right there, are you sure? Yes. Okay, I'm go ahead right. and take your card. Show the camera, I'm gonna look away, okay? Everybody you know the card? Yeah, okay. we got it. Go ahead and put it face down. We're gonna bring the rest of the cards on top. Now, when I give it a quick shake and a snap, that's gonna make your card jump right to the top. Yeah. Whoa! Again, just like that, we'll flip it back over. And here, actually, I'll let you be fair and go ahead and push that back in there for me. Perfect, okay? So watch, give it a little shake and a snap, or even a ripple. Comes right back to the top, look. This is the crazy part about the deck. That's what everybody wonders about, right? I'm gonna push you back in the top. People think that it automatically comes to the top. It doesn't until I want it to. Now, let's say I take a different card, okay? I can take the eight of hearts. Are you right-handed? Yes. Put your hand out flat and your other hand on top and hold it nice and tight, okay? Now, this is where it gets weird, like Freaky Friday, okay? Have you ever seen that movie? Yeah, absolutely. Or have you seen the original? Yes. Or have you seen the one with Lindsay Bowman? Uh, the original. Okay, here, so what's we gonna do? Right showing my age, just showing go my one. age. Okay. Go ahead, dude. Two, three, and when we turn it back on the count three, say switch. Ready? One, two, three, switch. switch. 
just like that, like three, two, five, and they're gonna switch positions. So now I have the eight, go ahead and look in your hand. And you have the seven of spades. But that's not the weirdest part right here. Go ahead and bring the camera close on this one, guys. All she has to do, and if she gets this right, she'll win a prize. She just has to get that seven to go face down right here. So just take it and put it face down. He's got it right there, in his mouth. What? <laughs> Pretty crazy, right? Well, let's say, you know, they could have chose any card in the deck, right? But this is the weirdest part, right? Just tap your card and say multiply. Multiply. This is a little trick magicians use, right? Now I can turn that entire deck into a bunch of the seven uh -huh. spades. Uh -huh. Give it a little uh -huh. cut and say change back and it goes back to being a normal deck. What? Just like that. <laughs> Thank you guys. Have a great night. You're awesome. He was awesome. New York, New York! For any of my friends who've never been to Vegas, you have to come. I can hook it up. Look at this. This is crazy. We got New York, New York. Look at this. Statue of Liberty. So awesome. Tropicana. We got down there. Look. Mandalay Bay. MGM. MGM. It's like a adult amusement park. It's so awesome. Like any one of those hotels, I can book you. I can bring you right here. So yep. let me know if you want to come to Vegas. Anything anyone wants to do in Vegas, Anything, you got them covered. Wants, I got everything. Whatever they want. All of it. If I want to go to uh, Planet Hollywood over there, you can take care of it? Yeah, absolutely. What about uh, Paris? Yeah, absolutely. All right. Oh, there's some, there's some time chairs like on the other side, like uh -huh. Hilton. And then we got um, Jockey Club over there, okay. Trump. Those are really nice too. Those have nice. kitchens. Uh, two bathrooms, balconies, jacuzzis. Cool. So Vegas, anybody wants to come to Vegas, you got them covered? I got it. This is your next vacation spot. Mm -hmm. All right, bye.